Telangana would go last to the poll and date of poll is 30th November with the date of issue of Gazette notification being 3rd of November. Mizoram, the date of poll will be 7th November and date of uh, counting would be 3rd which is common of course for all these states and elections in all these states would be completed by 5th of December. So date of uh, poll is 7th November. Similarly, in case of Chhattisgarh, the elections would be in two phase. The date of poll would be 7th November and 17th November. The nominations after Mizoram in the, for the two first phase of the Chhattisgarh would happen on uh, 20th, the, the 13th and the last date would be 20th, date of poll being 7th November and for phase two, 17th November. In Madhya Pradesh, uh, this uh, coincides with the second phase of Chhattisgarh and date of poll would be 7th November. So, first Mizoram and the first phase of Chhattisgarh, then second phase of Chhattisgarh and one phase in Madhya Pradesh. Thereafter, Rajasthan, where, where the date of poll will be 23rd November in one phase entirely in Rajasthan the date of issue of Gazette notification would be 30th October and date of counting for everyone being 3rd of December. Telangana would go last to the poll and date of poll is 30th November with the date of issue of Gazette notification being 3rd of November. And uh, the entire election process would be complete by 5th of December. So this is what is the schedule. And again, I request all of you, through all of you, to all the voters to please come and exercise in the festival of democracy in a true sense. Thank you very much.